Beast Nation, welcome back. All right, so as you guys know, the year is coming to an end. All right, I got on this. I started this YouTube channel this year, so this will be my first. All right. Uh, top 10 video. So I'm not doing like a top 10 movies or because I'm not a movie reviewer or I'm not a critic. All right? However, I do do reactions on trailers. All right. So this video is my top 10, my, the beast, my top 10 favorite trailers. All right. So like I said, this is mine. All right. If you guys have different ones, I'd love to hear in the comments. But let's go ahead. Like I said, uh, I just want to give you guys my point of view of which trailers are the best from 10 to 1. Um, and why I'm gonna give like a brief like why I thought it was the best. I'm not gonna go into depth, uh, do in depth with the actual trailers, all right? But let's get started. All right, coming in at number 10, all right? So, this trailer, right? I, I didn't even know anything about I was dreading doing a reaction of this trailer, but then once I saw it, I was like, oh my god, because this, this trailer is called the Belco, all right? Belco, it's like the Belco experiment, I think, but it's called Belco, or whatever. Uh, I didn't know anything about this trailer uh, when I first came into it, like I just said, but it was great. Uh, it was very suspenseful, obviously. I could tell this movie is going to be about, like, you know, they're stuck in a building and, like, this computer, some unknown computer is telling them, you can't do this shit. And, you know, some dude just walk around with a gun in the middle of the fire and it looks badass. So, right? people was dying out, don't worry, that's my type of movie. That's why it's on, it got a place in the Beast's top ten. Moving on, number nine, all right? Number nine is my personally favorite movie. It's my favorite movie, I don't care what you say. Don't attack me, it's my favorite movie. It's Batman v Superman, all right? So Batman v Superman, I wasn't a big fan of their trailers. Uh, I thought that the trailers were kind of uh, choppy, whatever. But the third trailer was a beast. When you saw Batman and you saw, you know, Alfred using this little hand thing, uh, you see a little bit more Batman in there. Alright, uh, because before all this uh, trailers was towards Superman, um, so you saw Batman actually kicking ass and stuff. That was a great trailer. That's why it goes on the top ten of my list. Moving on, number eight. Yes, number eight. This I just recently saw this movie. Actually, and I was so close to doing a review on it, but I'm like, dude, don't do it. They're gonna destroy you in the comment section because you don't know what the fuck you're talking about when it comes to movies, like actual critics wise. I'm not a critic. Uh, collateral Beauty. Uh, I thought Cloud Beauty's trailer was very like it's just mysterious. Like at first I was like, yo, man, are these spirits coming out? You know, why the spirits had crazy actors. The, the talent in this movie was just ridiculous, right? Um so in the tra like in the trailers, it's it was very powerful. It hits you where it's you know, it hits you, it hits you deep. Alright? You're like, what the heck is Will Smith doing? Why they got this, okay? So I personally love the trailer. That's why it's on the top 10. All right, number seven, okay? Civil War. This movie was great. I love the movie. Ah, uh, I'm not, because I'm not going to get into the movie-wise. The movie was okay, but the trailer-wise was very, very good, okay? Uh, what really won this trailer for me is Spider-Man. Spider-Man came out there like a base. Stole Cap Shield. He's like, what's up, guys? Like, what's going on, man? I'm here to kick ass. What are you doing? Uh, this is my Saturday. What the heck are you doing with your life? So I liked it. I, um, you know, you get to see, you, you, just, you saw like one half versus another half. You, you've seen everybody's movies, you've seen everybody in the previous movie, and now they're coming together and fighting. It was, it was, it was good. The trailer was good. Yes, definitely. Number six, I was so close. I was like, I was going through my list. I'm like, why am I putting this in here? Because this one pissed me off so much. Uh, it's Transformers, okay? The Last Night. It was an amazing trailer, but the reason why, actually, the fact that they actually did this, you know, when uh, freaking Optimus Prime got freaking Bumblebee and it's like, he's about to whoop his ass and look like he, he looked like he killed him um, or was going to kill him or whatnot. Um, obviously, I don't think he will, but who knows? Because Optimus Prime is evil now. I guess somebody's controlling him. So, um,. That got me. I was like, man, what in the world? You don't mess with Bumblebee. I, he's an American hero. Leave Bumblebee alone. So the fact that they did that, you know, it showed like, I don't, I don't know what direction it's going to. So it got me on the, you know, the tip of my toes, basically. So that's why it has to go on this top 10 list. All right, moving on. All right, number five. This is another good guy going bad. All right, the fate of the fast. The fate of 
Furious or some shit that's called. Uh, is the, the trailer was really good. You know, obviously coming off a dynamite movie that they had last time. And, you know, unfortunately with the passing of Paul Walker, you know, they had a great movie though. Uh, I, I didn't think they was going to make a movie. So when they did, obviously the trailer came out. I was like, oh my goodness. Okay, wow. Uh, the Rock destroys shit. And, you know, when he got in the prison, he's in the prison scene. He's like, Poof. you know, like, shit. Yes, I was all for it. Um, and then obviously you see Dom, he's bad now. I don't know if it's mind control or he's doing it for some certain reason. Obviously, I don't think he betrayed his family, but uh, I like the, the take, the, the going with it. He's the bad guy because that's the only dramatic change you can do from all the other Fast movies. All right, so I guess the movie before is all about family, loving, hugging, and now it's like, dude, fuck Fuck your family, you know. He and, and then the girl kissed him in front of the other. That was beast. I was like, what in the world just happened? To the, the whole world was spinning. So, yes. You're on the top 10. Congratulations, Don, with your badass Mr. 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 Number four. Spider-Man. 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 Who's that motherfucker Spider-Man? All right. So, Homecoming. That trailer was funny. It was just action. It was really just funny, badass funny. All right, you saw Iron Man was in it. You know, you saw him just like, hey, you, you know, you guys are not the Avengers. Uh, Hulk gives it away. I said, this kid is he's, he's a fourteen year old kid. You saw him in high school drooling over some little ass girl who just looks like a little girl to me, but still, I get the point. Um, but yes, Homecoming was good. The trailer was good. It was beast, and I can't wait. For, I this is one of the most anticipated movies. Is Yes. Number three. Now, this is the top three. The top three. So, you already know what top you are. You should have a good idea of the trailers, okay? But, anyways, top three goes to my girl, One Woman. One Woman, like, I was with this. Was probably the only trailer I was sitting here just like, when is it fucking coming out? Like, I was, I did three reactions of One Woman. <laughs> That's how much I love the damn trailer, all right? Uh, one woman comes out. She looks good as a geek. She looks good as a badass. She just looks good in general. All right? She did the, 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 the fuck you mean, bitch? I was just ah! so yes. Oh man, I want to watch trailer again. But yes, one woman, my girl gets it number three. All right, last two. All right, last two. So this one. Guardians of the Galaxy. All right, so Guardians of the Galaxy number two. I love the first Guardians of the Galaxy movie. The trailer right here just destroyed everything. Like, I think, I think the internet was about to break down. All right, Baby Groot was... Don't press that button. I'm Groot. No, that's the button I told you not to press. So try again. I'm Groot. Uh-huh. I'm Groot. Uh-huh. I'm Groot. No! So, it's like, God... Oh, that was such a good trailer. Uh, that it had to go high. You guys, are, I feel like you guys would have known that would have done a high for me. Okay, so yes, Guardians of the Galaxy. They got number two. Congratulations. All right, here it is. My favorite trailer of 2016. I bet you guys gonna think it's Star Wars, huh? Wrong. Wolverine. Wolverine. Logan. Whatever you want to call it. That was a beast trailer. I loved it. The freaking music. Everything, you know, just why he's all cut up. He just, it was sad, it was powerful. You know, he just fuck you in your feelings. Right the dude right in the face. And freaking bald man. Yes. Yes. Logan, old man Logan, congratulations. You're number one. This is my, I just, to me, yes. All right, guys. That finishes it. 2016's top 10 best reaction, uh, sorry, trailers. All right, so what do you guys think? Comment below what's your top 10. Or, yeah, comment below what's your top 10, okay? This is my like this is my personal opinion of what I feel what I thought okay so anyways guys thanks for watching thank you for being with me this year doing all these reactions that I've done all right you guys have been amazing 2017 hopefully it's gonna be a better year and keep getting better and better and better but you know what it is if you like this video like comment subscribe subscribe and share share other than that peace. <laughs>